Today we're going to be putting together TV stand the Walker Edison. So I got all the pieces lined up here on what we need. They all have numbers on them. You have the alphabet on all the parts. So you got A, B, C, D, E, F, and so forth. You know, there's kind of split between P and J in one bag. And some spare parts, which is good in case you mess up. So, 15, 16, A, and bolts, bolts, B. Anytime you're putting in a dowel, it says to put a little glue in the hole, put the dowel in there so it'll stay. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Got to use an H. That's gonna be those. That's H. Q, C, and P. This is P.
had to change this out because this not working at all. Securing 7, 8, 9, 10 into parts 3, 4, 5, 6 with the secure cam lock G. That's G. This is this secure cam lock. After building this, I realized there's just not enough space here and I'll have to move it into the floor to continue the build. I tried to move it into the floor, the end piece came off and it was just sitting there. So I got some Loctite, I'll just put that in there, that'll glue it in there for life. Alright, now to attach the bottom board here, we're going to be using these J's again. So we need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight of them. So the seat bolts putting the base on this now will be upside down step 12 slide the back panel 13 14 into grooves as per diagram
F and E to do the back. Okay, I just screwed in the back pieces. Uh, it's called a wedge, just to keep the panels from making noises and moving around. Now we got these R's. They are going to go. Shelf for pin D into the parts three, four, five, and six. This is D. These are the pins for the shelf. Now I gotta put the sliders together using N, K, M, and L. In this bag, S and T are both in there. T is for the handle, S is for the bolt to put it together. Here, now we just gotta put the doors on. All right, that's the finishing touch. Hope you enjoyed our video. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Booyah!